Meet eight-year-old Daisy. Daisy is a persistent, fun-loving second grader who has a heart for her stuffed red panda. This is her seven-year-old brother, Brent. He is a happy, positive, extroverted first grader who has a heart for learning. It's been a big summer for this brother and sister duo as it was a summer full of playing with toys, reading new books, new acorn spot, and experiencing some exciting new milestones. But nothing could top what officially happened to Daisy and Brent on July 15th when these two siblings gained a forever family. I'm a Wallace! And if you're a student at Hannibal LaGrange University, you might just know Daisy and Brent's new mom and dad. That's because HLGU registrar Jeremy Wallace and his wife, English professor Rachel Wallace, adopted Daisy and Brent. But they didn't stop there. The couple also have two biological kids and three foster kids. That's a total of nine people living here in the Wallace house. This family of nine wasn't always a family of nine as Daisy and Brent were first foster kids before they officially joined the Wallace family. I mean, I think without my faith, this wouldn't even be a conversation um, because without my faith, you know, I'm living life for what I can get. And fostering and even adoption is a tough road. Like, um, we get to share a lot of the good stories and like the things we've learned and, and it's nice to reflect on that, but the day-to-day -day is um, difficult. Along with gaining new kids, the Wallace parents say they also gained new information about the need for more people to open their homes to foster kids. You know, if every church would just get involved and one family from that church get into foster care and take one kid, um, we would not have a foster care crisis in our country. The sign in this photo really says it all, because for 402 days, Daisy and Brent have shared the same love and home, and now they also share the Wallace name. Reporting for HLGU News, I'm Kelsey McCoy.